All right, so now I'm getting ready to glue my overflow box together. And I've just got a simple jig set up here. Uh, what I did was stand this 45, just kind of made it tight to the table. Then I took a measurement from there to the other part of the 22 and a half. And then I found the, the thickness, which was 3 and 15 sixteenths, and put a couple of blocks in there. And then when I put a block on this side to kind of hold it, I can wedge everything together here so that everything um, just wants to sit right in place all by itself. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to set up, I'm not going to use the uh, the regular solvent. What I'm going to use is this uh, Weld On 16. And uh, it's just a little thicker stuff. It's more like uh, silicone almost when you use it. I'm just going to put, be able to put a bead down each seam and then just push this together and it should, uh, it should uh, really do a good job. Everything's lining up just perfect. And then all I plan on doing to make this so I can't see through my overflow box, I'm actually just going to sand it with a fine grit sandpaper on inside and out, and then it'll kind of make it look like a hazy look, which is not ideal. It'd be nice to have a black overflow box, but uh, the price of a, a sheet of black acrylic was quite expensive, so this'll be just as good. So I'll glue it up, and then I'll do another little shot to show you. All right, so here it is after I got my solvent uh, welded in place. So a little bit of the solvent came out a little bit but like I said to make this so I can't see through it I'm actually going to sand this whole overflow box so all that will disappear and it'll just look smooth but the seams came out absolutely flawless that weld 16 is really good for joining panels I almost think that I would glue uh, if I was to make a, a 10 foot sheet or try to make a 10 foot piece just use the weld 16 put it in between like that and uh, it makes a nice clear seam so now the next stage is we'll let this set up and then uh, I'll be installing this in the tank. So I'll shoot the video when I get that done. 